In this video tutorial, we want to take a look at the difference in URLs between the URL or the address for our blog and the URL or address to the post we have made on our blog. This is going to be very, very important when you are submitting assignments in Canvas that you get the correct address up here at the top. So right now we are at my blog, at Kelso's blog, and you'll notice right up here is the URL and it's going to be the name of my blog dot weebly dot com forward slash blog. If I turn in this link then a teacher is going to see my entire blog with all the posts um, in that blog. If I'm in a class and the teacher has asked me to post a reflection or an article to my blog then I would want to only turn in the link to that post. So I want you to watch watch this URL up here at the top and watch what happens when I click on the name of my blog. Now the name of my blog is Reflections on Blogging. So when I click on that look at my URL up here at the top. Look what happened. It kept the same blog URL but then it put a forward slash and it actually put the title to that blog post. So when a teacher is asking you to turn in a link to a blog post that you have done for that class, you want to make sure on the URL that you can see the name or the title of your blog post listed at the end. That way you can ensure that you are turning in the correct link so that you will get full credit on your assignment when you turn that in to Canvas. So once again, if I go back to just my blog, this is going to take the reader to my blog with all the different blog posts listed. If I click on the title, it is going to add the name of that title to the end of my URL. And now I know that if I give this URL, they will go directly to this article. And notice once they're on the article, they are able to leave a comment if I need to have comments back on my post. Thank you.